LBH, close enough. LBH. LBCH. Give it up for Ken Huntington. Ken Huntington has been around Long Beach for years. Yay! Doing sound for different bands and different bars. Ken's awesome. 45, uh, you're 45? Jimmy's 45. Oh, wait, you've been coming here? For, wait, what? 24. Jimmy's been coming in this bar for 24 years as of yesterday. He came in 24 years ago and he never left. Atta boy. Yeah, baby. Been drinking Kessler ever since. Woo! Give it up for Killer Ron. Yeah, Killer Ron! Yeah. Fucking crushed it. Fucking awesome. crushing it around all these old white people. We're like, hey, look at this guy. He's good. I like that chip. A little hippity hoppity. That's, that's some real nice stuff. Reminds me of Tupac. That guy's got a nice voice. I saw that Tupac on Coachella. <laughs> On the Coachella? On the Coachella, I saw him on looked, the YouTube. He looked a little strange though, I don't really looked know what's, what's going on there. Looked like his feet was moving and he wasn't moving, something, it was bizarre. Something was bizarre. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> alcohol! <laughs> yeah! Alcohol! Can we just stay up here and not do anything all night? Yeah! That's cool. <laughs> John Zedock, everybody. <laughs> Whatever. Vdac, Vop, whatever. Um, so, um, <clears throat> you know, some people say that after you turn 21 years old that it's all downhill from there. 45. 45, but I say that shit's baloney. I'm gonna tell you why. Because don't you know that there's one birthday out there for us guys that, well, it's, it's just as awesome as your 21st. And like your 21st birthday, you also have to wait for it because there's legal reasons and Jimmy wants to buy you a drink. Well, you're turning 36, just another birthday, or so you say. Get your stomach shades on, it's your birthday. What's that, you're too old for that? I don't think you really want to say that yet. You're just coming into your prime, go on and strut your stuff because you're looking just fine. Get your car washed, get your herd in, drink more Red Bull than you earned it. Find the 18 and up clubs, get yourself a VIP table and order some bub. Find the girls with the bracelets, yeah, they're on the 21. And you can tell them all about the wine cellar that you've got down in your basement. They all got short skirts on. They all got bracelets on, but you're too busy looking at the one who's barely 18 with the braces on. Well, you can't go to bed with a woman half your age unless you are at least 36 years of age. But throw your butt in jail, you'll get familiar with a large male. Celebrate year 36, find someone half your age and have some sex. Have some sex. Have some sex. Find someone of your age and have some sex with Jimmy. Have some sex with Jimmy. Have some sex with Jimmy. Yeah, yeah. Mustache rides. Got to admit I'm pretty excited for a birthday coming up in like 20 years when I'm the star of Real Housewives of Beth Hills. Divorce from Jared Leto and dress to kill. I like him right now and I like him more than 21 year olds. They're so much fun. Can't wait to be a cougar. Yeah, when I'm 42 girl. Latin can be twice as nice. You can't imagine all the hotties working in my place. And this is your uniform. Oh my god, that is a really small thong. And it's like skin colored. Will you wear it for me, Daddy? Oh no. Please don't. <laughs> if you're gonna go to bed with a dude half your age, make sure he isn't gay. And he just wants you to say when they're drunk on red wine. Find a stud on your 42nd and have some sex. Have some sex, have some sex. Go on, girl, get the seats in the band's wet. Don't judge, life is full of jerks. Don't judge, I'm doing God's work. 21-year-olds love to be told what to do. And I'm teaching them how to be good and bad for you and you and you too. Oh, it might sound a little creepy. 
sleazy. sleazy. If I bang two regular sized 18 year olds, it's like banging one fat 36 year old. Well, you can't go to bed with a woman half your age unless you are at least 36 years of age. They'll throw your butt in jail. <laughs> Happy birthday, Jimmy! Many times, Jimmy. Happy birthday. birthday Jimmy. Anybody else wants to buy Jimmy a shot? I just bought one. It's your turn. Woo! Do you have to drive home, Jimmy, or are you walking? Hell no. Yeah! yeah buy him more shots. Home you live what? I'm off tomorrow. Fuck yeah. 2 a.m. I say we give him a hangover till 9 p.m. tomorrow. Yes. Give him tequila and whiskey and just mix it all. Just like pour. Give him a, a three wise men. You guys ever had three wise men shots? <laughs> Whoa, it's Johnny Walker Black, Jameson, and Jack Daniels all in one shot. Or you give a hand job to a camel. And then that too. Yeah. That's what happens after you get a three wise men shot. That's you end like up getting hand jobs Sunday to camels. Night, right? uh -oh. oh, wow. Uh -oh. Wow. I'm calling it out. You give hand jobs to camels every Sunday night? Yeah, why do you think I'm always so happy? Oh, gosh. <laughs> and late. Almost like Mary. Oh. Whoa. We're stalling. Because we have a lot of time left. <laughs> um, so this song... Who likes to smoke weed? I do. Yeah, LBH. Jimmy, do you like to smoke weed? Do you like to smoke weed? Hell no. Hell no, don't you lie to me. How about Hell no. All right. Sophia, do you like to smoke weed? Yeah, this song's for you, baby. This song is for you and your fabulous upper body. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to be as nice about your giant, great big, fabulous boobies as I can. <laughs> Just smoked a J and now your ass is really, really high, 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 high. Taco Bell don't deliver, so what you gonna do, 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 do? You walk your ass to the munchie store, that's just what you do, 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 do. I said do, do. A crazy bum stops the entrance to the munchie store, but you distract him by throwing quarters on the floor. You're puffing Chiba, smoking Reefa Everybody bring your sense of media Take a hit, you might choke a bit But you'll end up saying, man, that's some really good shit Shit, 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 Dan has good shit, yeah I like some green crack sativa gets me going And the more, 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 more where is my lighter? I left it here last night, I could have sworn. Sophia, this one's for you. I've got a bulge in my pocket, and it's known as God's gift, 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 yeah. yeah. Barely enough bulge to make the world skinny and slip, 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 well, I gotta make slip. Like dirt. Well, here's a lesson, it's not about the quantity. It's how it makes you feel, it's all about the quality. Are we still speaking of the weed or the bulge you call a gift, 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 gift? I think it's a gift. We'll puff and cheap us, smoking a reefer. Everybody bring your sense of media. Take a hit, you might choke a bit, but you'll end up saying, man, that's some really good shit. Shit, 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 shit,
Get your mushrooms and your weed ready. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, Guys, wait, I have to talk to you about something oh, real oh, quick. Sorry. This is really serious. I really feel like a lot of businesses lately are kind of trying to make me look stupid on Facebook. Like my salt really wants me to like them. I mean, Morton, you're delicious and all, and the girl with the umbrella is really hot, but... I don't really know so much if our relationship status needs to be shared with all of Facebook. TurboTax wanted me to like share my tax triumph with my friends. No, um, I don't really consider making just a little bit above the poverty line a triumph. Because I really could have used that earned income tax credit. And I didn't quite uh, make the, the smaller amount there. really sucks. But, um, what are you gonna do? Facebook is fucking awesome. I mean, I'll check in at the Goodwill. Why not? If I can be the mayor of G-Dub, you know, post a mobile upload of the newish panties I'm gonna buy. Yeah. I don't know. That's checking in at the Goodwill and sharing my tax triumph, are, neither of which are gonna get me laid. So, I mean, isn't that what Facebook is for? That's that's what I took away from the social network, personally. Yes. I don't know. But, fuck it, man. We have a song about Facebook. Yeah. I think whenever chicks talk about panties, that instantly makes them more fuckable. Yes. <laughs> right? Okay. I'm just saying. I hope it, I mean, maybe it made you feel kind of funny inside. Like talking when about you used panties. to find legit ropes and gym class? Yeah. They made me feel funny inside. Of, Itchy outside. We're gonna do some country now. If you see a silly picture of a kitty in a glass and you want to tell your friends about how hard it made you laugh, well, don't it make you happy that you got yourself a phone with the Facebook app? It's sure freaking new. You took a bunch of pictures with your friends at the bar just so you could show everybody how cool you really are. Create your phone. On your Facebook and be sure to tag the peanuts. You're feeling like a loser because you just got dumped and you're on the prowl for some rebound, rebound love. love. Change your profile picture to the one with your shirt off. It shows your six pack ass. Well, you heard a deep quote that you don't understand, but you want them ladies thinking you're a wise, sensitive man. What do you do, boy? You Google that shit. Yeah, post, post it on your Facebook. Facebook. Well, you can write a blog and then pimp it out on Facebook. I do, why not? Or make an invitation to a party in your bed on Facebook. Corey, do it every night. People will find you that you ain't seen since high school on, on Facebook. Facebook. Which will remind you that you never even wanted a Facebook. Yeah, Facebook's got it. Share of problems, y'all, but you know that little family sidebar, you know, that really helps me because I got 28 kids, I don't remember all their damn names. Thanks, FB. Well, you get into a comment fight with a dude on your wall, so you try to delete him from your friends list once and for all, only to find that he deleted you first. What a bunghole, 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 Check out your farm bill, cause someone tipped your cow. There's a box in your garden, gotta get, get him out now. now. And spend five bucks on some fake wood for a fake, fake barn on your Facebook. They ought to call it fake wood. Well, people don't like it when you change stuff around on, on Facebook. Facebook. Again and again. So I think I'll make a fan 
Instagram page with that exact title on Facebook. I still like it and share it with a friend. Everyone should always check out their ex-lovers on Facebook. Because you'll be really happy when you see their photos and they're all fat and ugly and they got five kids and they're still married to the McDonald's up the street from the high school in the same small town where you grew up in and the only thing that they got going on on their Facebook walls is a bunch of videos about shit nobody says. Yeah, have you seen the shit California say? I took the 710 to the 405 to the 5 here, it was awesome. Oh, 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 oh. oh Facebook. You good? Like well, it's his birthday. He needs like four more. Jimmy, if if life were Facebook, I would like you right now. A uh, little thumbs up would pop up. You didn't show no way in. That was so cute. That was cute. <laughs> well, <laughs> the dish master. Dish master oh, Redondo Beach player. So I'm so sorry. Woo! You know, to be fair though, I I am kind of like happy. I mean. I would probably like Murph's adult diapers or um, uh, uh, uh. Casey Anthony's line of duct tape. Yeah. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Too soon. Wow. Too late. Hey. He's coming out with a new product called the Trump Line. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Guaranteed to wash yeah. all the blood away in one hose swipe. What, what are we doing next? You know what? Wow. No, wait. Hold on. Oh. Speaking of Casey Anthony. <laughs> oh. 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 No, spe oh, speaking of people who have children they're not ready for, um, does anyone else here watch 16 and Pregnant? I know you're all so manly. Hey, hey how's it? <laughs> good. It's real good. Yeah. 16 and Pregnant. Or as I refer to it, my own personal form of birth control. Because, quite frankly, one episode of that and I don't want any action below the belt line because, oh my god. How come all the guys on that show are the same? They all, they all kind of talk like this. And they, they say things like, I'm gonna go get me a DNA test. I don't think that kid is mine. We only had sex one time. I didn't even come. I just had little droplets. <laughs> I pulled out. He pulled out. Oh, what a guy. You know what? Dude's on 16 and pregnant. Don't get a DNA test because it's obvious you're the father, but leave that poor little innocent girl the faintest glimmer of hope that maybe she actually got prego from the toilet at the Piggly Wiggly. Right? I mean, even Maury Povich would agree with that, right? I like reality shows and I am not ashamed and in fact this next song is about reality shows. Go fig. That's young talk for go figure. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for laughing, Mary. <laughs> you always make me laugh, Corey Pierman. <laughs> you wanna laugh, Jimmy? You want to see the size of my penis? Ah, just kidding, I'm not showing you. Thank you. 
Pop Show. Bitch, I'm true. Wednesdays at 9, 8 central on NBC. You guys just just hang out for a second. Hold on. And Nolwood. Nolwood. Been there. Hey, I was in church. No shit. Called Nolwood Grace. Nice. I like it. My God appears here as a gift. Music's going along yeah. with the story. Uh, yeah. Did you go to prison in Lyman? That's no, a bad I one. Lyman, so Lyman, Colorado has like the maximum security prison like in the middle of America and it's like in Tornado Alley. Which is where they should really put all of the maximum security prisons. Just throw them all in Tornado Alley and be like, good luck boys. Hope you make it out. You died, sorry. Shouldn't have killed that guy. Anyway. Hey, can you tell a story about dead roommates? About dead roommates? Yeah. Oh, let's see here. While I came home, I came home, home and I saw a pool of blood. I thought I had left my toilet seat down when I left in the morning, but maybe I didn't. I don't have a roommate though, so I can't really sing about it. I'll think of one and I'll write it for next time. Yeah! That guy can go fuck himself. This show has taken a turn. I think it's time for a cover song. This is, this is by an artist who really, really touches my soul. And I'm really surprised she hasn't won any Grammys yet. I'm sure she's going too soon. So you guys definitely keep an eye out. And um, sing. Sing along if you know the words. Thank you. 
A booby fan? He likes man's butts. Do you like man's butts? Is that what I heard you say? Will Norris said he likes man butts? Oh my god. Men's butts. Well, this song is not for you then. <laughs> Alright, we gotta come up with a men's butt cancer song. Shit. <laughs> I really have to pee. Wait, what are we doing? We're going to roll the floor. I skipped the song, but we can come back to it. It's fine. It's cool. I think we should end with that song, though. We're ending with the other one. Oh. Yeah. Oops. Right. Whatever. Story. Yeah. I think we should end with that other one. Behind the music. <laughs> Listen here, you dumbass. We should end with the other one. I quit. Okay. <laughs> Ron, you want to hear that blue song? Here it comes. <laughs> Oh yeah, okay. I don't even know. 
So if you can I get another beer? Just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Really doesn't want another beer. Oh, you got like three songs left or something? Yeah. yeah. Wow. yeah. Like, We're the Raging something. Peanuts. Look us up online, y'all. If you like this next song, you can find it online. Search for the Raging Peanuts. Share it with your friends. Send it to anybody that you know. This is like our, our one like, you know, actual good cause song. And we'd kind of like for good things to happen from this song. It's for a good, a really good I, cause. I think the song about fucking people have your age is for a good cause. But not as good as this one. You know, this one's for bad stuff. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, roller girl. All right. <laughs> Well, some are big and some are small, like an egg or a basketball. Some are hidden so well you can't tell if they're there at all. They come in all shapes and colors. One size don't fit everybody. If you don't like what you got, well, all it takes is some hard earned money to get what you want. Now you gotta go and float them out in public, girl. Seeing all the heads turn like the dudes were all old till the world. Well, I'll get involved in your cause if you just let me make a that smooth satin pink ribbon on your lapel. Where all of them are picture perfect Help save the food Help save the food One day there will be a time Where no one loses any boobs Help save the boobs We need to save the boobs Cause that pink ribbon on your lapel Supports breast cancer research Couldn't you tell? Cause breast cancer sucks See you later, Jimmy! Happy birthday, Jimmy! Go get some movies! Yeah. So grab your boob and check it. Massage in circles. Careful not too hard. You don't you want, want to turn purple. purple. If you got no lumps and you got no bumps, then your boobs are in good health. But check it every now and then and give me a call if you want some help. help. I'll be yours, you'll be mine. What do you get breast cancer to? Guys, got a massage and check your man boobs. So go ahead and have a party. Invite all your friends. Everybody take your tops off. We're gonna do some breast exams. While John funnels the thong and it's really creeping me the fuck out. I know. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man, just leave it alone. Yeah, we have nightmares. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go to a land where all of them are picture perfect. Help save the boobs. Help. Any boobs. Help save the boobs. We need to save the boobs. Get a pink ribbon on your lapel and donate cash to breast cancer research as well. Cause breast cancer sucks. No, you don't have the guitar for that one. Or are we doing the older one? Oh, I don't need my guitar for this Corey one. is so drunk right now. He doesn't yeah. know what's going oh, on. No, no bullshit. Yeah. She's got it backwards on there. No, I don't. Okay. No, I don't. <laughs> anyway. I'm not even going to attempt the tambourine on this one. I'm trying. Corey, I think... Sophia, can I get the shot? At this point... What? I'm not really drunk. She just you know. called Corey up for being a lightweight. <laughs> I just want to savor this moment. That was good. Shut up and start the song, Mary. No, wait, I have an instruction for you. I think <laughs> you should take the mic out and dance around because all my luck, you're I'll clearly feeling it, so just go with it. I'll just dance up here. I don't want to get feedback. No, dude, you'll be fine. I just did it and it was fine, so just all do right, Well, it. you got to start the song first. Okay. Don't disappoint me, brother, from another mother. This is the oddest show ever. <laughs> Just pretend like Jameson. you're a hippie child. <laughs> yes. A and a Grateful Dead Party. show. Just go yeah, dude. Perfect. I want to be Jerry Garcia. Oh, yeah. I'm a 
Oh, touch of gray. <laughs> oh, Lord. This is a mashup of a bunch of songs. Cheers. So, good night. Even in the military, I see it. Yummy. Yeah, he, he left the tank out in the field. <laughs> I'm not making that up. What John happened? Z-Dag, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Jerry Garcia was actually in the military and he left his tank out somewhere. <laughs> so high up. Big surprise. Dude, this acid makes me want to get out of this tank. <laughs> you ready, bro? I'm ready, sis. You know what it is. Black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. No one know how to make him stop and stare as I zone out. I can't even handle it right now. Watching you, watching me, I go all out.
You guys down for that? Uh, they might be out of town. Boo. At war. Boo. Whatever, we'll figure something out. But stick around for Northern Strangers because they're coming up next and they're awesome. Yeah. I concur. With I all concur. original music. You concur? Yeah. All original music tonight? Yeah, because like the other two times they've been here, the, the three times they've been here, they've done Pink Floyd's The Wall and Pink Floyd's Dark Side of the Moon. And it was awesome and it was like, woo! high and then we'll come back in but tonight I'm looking forward to hearing some real shit. Yeah. Oh show. Original. You're still gonna go get high. OG and coming up Spanish next. You should Spain. still get high. <laughs> I probably will. Yeah. Right. By the way we're supposed to get high in the alley in the back. Yeah. Okay. Just so you know. I, I might do it. I'm seriously do you guys see me dancing over here? <laughs> Waterfalls and raindrops. Not funny. <laughs> <laughs> ruh, ruh, ruh. Oh, let's go. Let me see that Tootsie Roll. Wait, I gotta put my sunglasses on. Uh, stretch out the old. Okay. California love. Alright, stop what you're doing. Cause I'm about to ruin the image and the style that you used to. I look funny. But sure I'm making money, it's the ECO world, I hope you're ready for me And I gather round, not the new fool in town My sound's laid down, but I'm underground I'll drink up all the Hennessy you got in your shell Just let me introduce myself, my name is Humpty Pronounce with a Humpty, and oh, oh, I said Yo, it is, I would like to Humpty If I got to bring it to you cowards, then it's gonna be quick I had all you fans up in the jail before, suck my dick And I'll live on the cats you run with, get done with, done quick How the fuck you going cross a dog with bum shit? I take out a gun flick, nine one one shit All of us are dumb shit, ain't this dumb shit? You remind me of a strip club, cause every time you come around it's like, what? Well, I just gotta get my dick up You have a dick? What the fuck is going on here? Uh -huh. 
Cause you're on a mission, and you're wishing that someone could cure your lonely condition. You like big bugs and you cannot lie. I got some other brothers just can't deny. When a girl walks in with an itty bitty waist and a round thing in your face, sweet! From frustration, first inclination is to become a mom and leave the situation. But every dog don't want to find a hope. Don't hang yourself with a celibate rope. Ooh, baby, I wanna get a witch up And take your witch up But my homeboys try to warn me But that butt you got makes me so horny Ooh, rump of smooth skin You say you wanna get in my bands You run over there without a second to lose And what comes next? No, but thank you for playing along <laughs> Ooh, mama Chata Ooh, what a wonderful foray Looking for some gear to buy But when I saw this girl, she could rock my world And I had to adjust my fly She looked at me and smiled and said You got plans for the night? I said Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis When I was dead broke and I couldn't picture this And a 50 inch screen, money greens on the sofa Got two rides, a limousine and a show car Four mil about two G's flat No need to worry, my account handles that So we journeyed to our house One thing led to another I keep the dough and cold hit the floor I looked up and <laughs> there was their mother. Oh my god. Woo! There it is. Well, you know, parents aren't the same no matter time, no place. They don't understand that us kids are gonna do the wild thing. Cause I'm sitting at home with my dick on hard. So I grab a black book for a freak to call. Picked up the telephone and down the seven digits. Say, yo, fat girl, come here. Are you ticklish? Yeah, I called you fat. Look at me, I'm skinny, I want it never stop Me from getting busy, I'm a doggy and heat A freak without warning and an appetite for sex Cause it's so boring, I'm a freak I like the girls with the boobs And I once got busy in the Max Steiner's bathroom After I peed When was that again? Well, I had to pee first and then I think it was on a Friday, Friday So please don't try to fade me. But uh, back to the next at hand. Perfection is perfect, so I let him understand. From a young G's perspective, and before me digging a bitch, I had to find a contraceptive. Yeah. We never know she could be earning a man, learning a man. At the same time, burning a man. I get the back to this bitch named Sophia. She used to be the homeboy's lady. Oh, damn. Yeah. 80 degrees when I tell the bitch, please raise up these and you tease, cause you get still <laughs> As a model with northern strangers fill the trees Biatch just rolling down the street Smoking in dough Sipping on gin and juice Laying back with my mind and my money and my money Everybody! Rolling down the street Smoking in dough Sipping on gin and juice Laying back with my mind and my money and my money Alright, we're doing that again, everybody! Rolling down the street Back. One more time, one more time, everybody sing! Rolling down the street, smoking 
to the story about a girl named blah blah blah, blah, blah that adored me so we started talking and getting familiar and spent a lot of time so that we could build a relationship some understanding of how it's gonna be in the future we was planning everything was dandy and oh so sweet i had no idea i was in for a treat after this was established everything was cool the tour was over and she went like a school i called her every day to see how she was doing every time that i called her Friend. Don't give me that. Just don't even give me that. What's this? You, you got what I need. But you say he's just a friend. You say he's just a friend. Oh, baby, you, you got what I need. You say he's just a friend. You say he's just a friend. You got what I need. You know me. You know what OPP. Yeah, you know TRP? Yeah, you know. Who's there with TRP? Everybody. In four months. I like you boom boom down. I like you boom boom Said that Max Snyder's the shit. Mm -hmm. And I gotta say, eh, eh, today was a good day. I didn't even have to use my A. Sophia, because she's got big movies and we love them.